Well, 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 I said I wanted to get up at 9, and I did. It is closer to 9.30 now because I've been puttering on my phone and getting my vlog set up to edit, but, you know, that's good. <laughs> We're making baby steps back towards getting up at a reasonable time on a regular basis. I honestly haven't even had time to think about what I want to do today, so I don't really know where to start. <laughs> I slept pretty all right. I definitely had weird dreams. I can't remember them now, but... When I woke up, I was like, oh, those are weird. So that's always fun. Maybe it'll put me in a creative mood today to want to do my story stuff. It's still there. It just sits every day there and mocks me. But we'll see. But anyways, I am just getting the vlog ready to go now. I'm just gonna put the time lapse on the clips that need the time lapse and then render it. And then I'll probably go grab a breakfast drink for breakfast <laughs> because I'm really hungry. And, um... I don't feel like cooking, so <laughs> that's my solution. Anyways, so that's where we're at. Just want to jump on and start the vlog because I woke up early. It is currently 9.29, so. <laughs> Anyways, with that, I'm going to go for now and try to figure out what the heck I want to do today because I really have no idea at all. <laughs> well, hello. I have gotten dressed in like a real shirt, I feel, and I pulled out a clean pair of sweatpants from the closet instead of just wearing the same pair of sweatpants that I've been wearing like for the last weeks. I wear them, I wash them, I put them back on. So this is exciting, put on some makeup because why not? And I'm almost halfway through my list of things to do for the day, which is very exciting and it's only 11.30. I am being productive. Can I stay on that productive train? I don't know, that is a question for later. <laughs> I set up my agenda for next week, kind of, I mean, as much as I could, so that's exciting. I need to do invoicing again today, like I mentioned yesterday. I want to try to do some writing stuff, but we'll see. I need to cut some linings and sew some masks and um, exercise, hopefully. And I actually need to have lunch here soon because I'm getting pretty peckish. Like, I had my breakfast drink, which will last for a while for sure, but it takes a while to cook and I'm getting hungry, so I should probably get on that, I'm thinking, and then um, I'll be excited and rejuvenated to keep going, I think. <laughs> Anyways, that's where we're at. <laughs> I don't even know. Like, I feel like I'm being pretty, I'm feeling awake. That's key because prior to like yesterday and today, I had been getting less than four hours of sleep or like between four and five hours of sleep every night for quite a while and it's just, it was exhausting. So I'm feeling much better now that I'm getting some sleep. I got nine hours the night before, I got eight hours last night. I'm becoming human again, which is amazing. But yeah, I think what I'm gonna do now is go downstairs, cook some food, maybe socialize a bit and then come back up and I'm thinking probably cut the linings for my masks because the sewing part doesn't take me too too long because I've like got it down to close to an art it's not perfect but it, you know it goes pretty quickly it's just the cutting that takes forever so I might cut everything to match up all the exteriors that I have and then get to sewing because it is what day is it today it is the 26th and uh, like I said yesterday again I'm running out of time before my girly goes to work and she needs masks so that's where we're at and then hopefully get some writing done I just need to stop dreading it I just need to do it honestly it's like 20 after 1 and I'm hitting my afternoon nap time so I'm going to try to stay awake, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut some more linings for my masks. I think I've, like, I count it. It can't be 19. I count it 19, but I think it's 13 <laughs> because I did some. See, now I'm confused. So I know there's nine of these ones that I got from Walmart. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13. I was right. But before I get into doing the linings... My poor pattern is just dying a little bit because I've been using it for quite a while now. Unfortunately, I do have a second one here, so I'm just going to cut this out. Eventually, I want to transfer this over to like some cardstock. I think I have cardstock, but I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> and also, like, how much longer am I going to make masks for? Like, once I go to Blind Channel, I'm going to stop because I'll, one, have a ton of masks, and two, I'll be in Blind Channel. So, anyways, I'm going to cut this out and probably get on my headphones here, listen to an audiobook, and uh, we'll be good to go.
Well, this took a lot longer than it should have because I just kept taking breaks in between. But also like cutting out 13 and tracing 13, it's just, it's a little bit of effort. Um, but somewhere along the way, I stopped and I played Mario Party for a bit and my sister-in-law came and dropped off my Dungeons and Dragons stuff. I think the intention is probably supposed to be to continue D&D online. I don't know. But um, yeah, so I have 13 linings done now. I still have to trim them obviously, but baby steps, we're getting there. And so I think the next big project that I'll do, and I probably won't do it today, but that will be to cut enough ties for 13 masks. <laughs> so yeah, but baby steps, baby steps all the time. I don't know where my list went. There it is. <laughs> Let's see, now that I have cut the linings, must get pens. Sew masks, which I don't think I'm gonna do today. But like I said, if I cut the ribbons, then I can sew all the ribbons on at the same time, and then I can do all the pinning, and the pinning takes forever. But I could probably watch a movie while I do that. Invoicing, it's just one account I have to do, so it won't take me, it'll take time, but it won't take like forever. And then my writing. I'm getting really tired though, because I've just been in the house all day. Bored in the house and I'm in the house bored. <laughs> bored in the house and I'm in the house bored. Yeah, but I'm not super bored is the problem. I'm just lazy. Lazy in the house and I'm in the house lazy. <laughs> Anyways, I think what I'm gonna do... I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Maybe I'll trim that because then I'll at least feel like those are good to go. And then maybe clean up the mess over there. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Today is a day of... I don't know. Alrighty, so I took some time and I cut all the ribbons for these dudes here. Look at that stack. You can see what's the lining and what's not. And it's just after six now and my mom and I are ordering in. We we're gonna do pizza. Well, they were gonna do pizza. I was gonna do 7-Eleven because I really want potato wedges, <laughs> but uh, her boyfriend had to go to work. So we're just gonna do something together, but we didn't decide what we want to order previously and my mom's asleep right now and I just went downstairs to kind of try to wake her up but I don't want to wake her up but she sh should probably wake her up um so I don't know I guess we'll go back downstairs with some of my dishes because I had a snack earlier and um maybe I can wake her up now because it's six and it'll probably take like half an hour to 50 minutes to get whatever we order so we should probably order now but I feel good that I did those ties because now it's all just assembly and that is okay I'm kind of tired but I didn't nap so I think that's a win right I don't even know anymore I don't even know what is life <laughs> alrighty so dinner was had we ordered from 7-eleven because it's new my mom got an entire pizza and I got all the potato wedges I got chicken strips too I ate one I just ate a lot of potato wedges and I feel really sick now as a result and I should have seen this coming <laughs> but it was in the moment worth it now not so much anyways it is 9 30 now i just finished doing my invoicing for the week and by week i mean ending this week on sunday it i'll definitely be doing more invoicing later this week but i'm feeling pretty good about getting that done it wasn't as bad as i thought it would be it was a half an hour but i thought it was gonna be so much worse so that is exciting i cleaned up a bit i feel part of me wants to continue to be productive which i have been except the only things left on my list are exercising which is too late to do because i'll be up all night if i exercise i know that's an excuse that i keep using but it's true um <laughs> and writing, and then sewing masks. I don't really feel like doing any more sewing today, and I think we know my answer to the writing thing. I'm actually feeling pretty tired, so I might actually just climb into bed and put on a movie, and maybe try to get to sleep early tonight, maybe. I'm gonna go into work tomorrow, but I'm not gonna go in until a little bit later. I'm not gonna go in at eight. I think I'm gonna go in at like 10-ish, maybe nine. I don't know. We'll figure that out. I'm not too concerned at the moment, but yeah, my tummy hurts. My bad. It is raining outside real good. That's great. And um, I need to figure out my hours this week at work because I am down to my last couple hours. I think I have like 18 hours and 15 minutes <laughs> for this week. 
Um, I obviously need to get an exact amount at some point, but that is fine. I got a couple days. I know it's in the 18 hours area, so that's fine. And then the next week it'll be interesting to see what the heck happens with having a job or not. I mean, I know I'll have at least a couple hours a week, but a couple hours a week does not a paycheck make. I mean, it does, but not a livable paycheck. So, and which is crazy too, because normally May and June are like our busiest months, like April, May, June busiest months for the theater and so it sucks so much to not be working during this time but it's fine we'll do what we can and um yeah I I think I'm gonna get ready for bed I think that's what's gonna happen because like I said I'm feeling pretty tired but accomplished it doesn't seem like I did a lot today and honestly I probably didn't do as much as I could have but it's fine so I'm gonna go now get ready for bed and I will check in with you before I climb into it <laughs> Alrighty, well it is now officially the end of the night. It is 10.30. I got ready for bed and then I made my mom play some Mario Party mini games with me for a while because my intention is to do a games night where I actually bring my Switch downstairs and we all play Mario Party together. And so I wanted to see how my mom did with the mini games. We just played some mini games. And the reason I wanted to see how she did with them was because we tried playing Overcooked and it went terribly. And she was like, it was just because it was on the small screen because we were just playing on the little Switch screen. And so I was like, so if um, we played on a big TV, you'd be fine. And she's like, because <laughs> that game does get pretty hectic. But anyways, that was a lot of fun. I think we played like 10 or so. But now, like I said, it is 1030 and it's time for me to go sleep because I work tomorrow and I'm going in for nine, I think, so I'm sleeping a little bit, but still, still. <laughs> so with that, I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure, and I will see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. <laughs> Good night.